morning. It's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. How are you guys doing? Okay, so I'm back with a um, collective haul. Actually, collective haul mean I this is something I've been ordering over the past three, four weeks, and I just hadn't had a chance to put it up. And also because they were all part of the two for one uh, Tuesday sales from Cheap Scrapbook scrapbook stuff so if you haven't gotten on her email list get on there because on every tuesday of the month for the most part um every tuesday of the week i'm sorry she uh tony will have a um buy one get one free type thing so the whichever is the lower price so anyway um she has different theme every week so i one week she had these um chipboard stickers i got a whole bunch let me show you i got the hike more from 49 and market super pretty i do have this collection already so i'm just looking to pick up the chipboard stickers most of these that i'm showing you now is around um 350 to 450 so i got it for around 175 to 225 this one is also 49 and market in the leaves and that's kind of a little bit of a folly um collection really pretty though and then i i did not have this one for whatever reason i do have this collection already but i was missing the chipboard accent every time um echo park had the sales they never seemed to have this one so i was able to get this for about two dollars and this one was around 225 uh, flower garden again i have this entire collection actually i bought it as part of clip ep and Club Echo Park um, back in May of last year, and they, um, you know, they didn't have everything with it. I didn't purchase everything with the club, and I was missing this phrase one. I do have the Gather at Home collection already as well, and this, I was missing the frame, so I got that for around $2.25, 2 50 These were around $1.50 because it's an older collection. So they had it on sale for $3 or something like that. So I got it for $1.50 because it's two for one. Whatever, these two were about the same price. I got it for that. This is a Echo Park Collection Easter. Super cute. Chipboard accent. And this one also chipboard accent with I Love Summer. And this one was around $3 as well. So I got basically two of these for $3 instead of each for $3, right? So that was awesome. And then, um, hold on a second, let me close the door real quick. Okay. And then they also had a um, little bit more expensive sticker, uh, chipboard sticker. I got, whoops, oh, screwy. I got this, um, I bought a um, tuxedo and tiara from Bow Bunny paper pad recently and this one was I think around $6.50 so I got it for $3.25 that's really good price isn't it for these large chipboard this was around $5.50 so I got this one is the collection called Elegance from Graphic 35 they have these 6 by 12 chipboard stickers and then these were around I think these were around four seventy five or four eighty, so let's say. So I got it for two forty each. This is the photo play North Pole collection. I have the collection. I just didn't have the chip. Actually, most of the time, I never see photo play with the chipboard stickers. I think they make them. They used to make them, or they make them every so often, but they don't make them for every collection. This is Tula Norbert Christmas party, also about the same price. And then I was able to get all these new. Well, some of them are new um chipboard these are really thick because they're both sides so let me show you farmhouse this was called what farm sweet farm the new prima collection and it's on both sides and these were um these were sorry let me see the prima was 560 or so let's say so i got it for 280 for all of these okay for each this one is the Hello Pink Autumn. I do have this collection already, and I but I don't have the chipboard. It's not pretty. This one I do. This is the new one called Meal, and I don't have the collection yet. Yet I have, but I really like some of the papers. So I will pick up some of that to use with these chipboard. So again, these were two eighty. 
This one is My Sweet. It's an older collection of Frank Garcia. And I do have the collection. I just need the chipboard stickers. And this one is called Peach Peach Tea. It's a new collection um, from uh, Prima. And I don't have the collection yet. I have a few paper from it. But I like the most of the embellishment on this chipboard. So I got that too. And then this one is pretty pale. This is an older collection, so it was less. I think it was four seventy or something like that. So I got it for two thirty five. This is so pretty. It has rose gold in it. Isn't that gorgeous? It's a very pale. It's called pretty pale for a reason. It's a very pale collection. This one was the same. It was about two twenty five. Um, this is called surfboard, and it's a very California um collection very pretty kind of soft a, a soft um colors really gorgeous i actually love it and i have i have the collection already um this one is called watercolor floral this is beautiful watercolor flowers and as you can tell here but i was missing this so i got that and this is a the with love collection from frank garcia and also I was missing this, I got that. So that was such a great deal. I was so happy to get all these things to go with my stuff. And then I got a bunch of, um, what do you call it? Um, enamel dots. She had, oops, she had um, en enamel dots on sale. Usually she had two different things on sale for that, the two for one Tuesday. So I don't remember what the enamel dot was with, but I got the enamel dots from um, from Simple Stories for about uh, one ninety each. They're normally um, five dollars or four dollars or something like that. I got the Feeling Frosty, the Heart and Home, the beautiful um, uh, Country Harvest, and Rustic Christmas. The Bow Bunny. Uh, one was, let me see how much those were. The fancy pants I'm going to show you next is uh, about $1.90. And the bow bunny, all of these on top is around two, um, let me see, two, less than two, 240. That's pretty good, right? I have tons of Nouveau stuff, but I do like the pre-made enamel dots. I picked those up. That's that's such a good price. It was just like, and most of those I have collections for them already. And these are the real pretty um, uh, fancy pants one. This is Peachy Keen. These are all, what did I tell you? Two, one, these were fancy pants was $1.90 pretty good for all these right this is called cozy christmas and this is lake life so very summery one and this is the new one my type super pretty very red white and blue so that was all i picked up for um whatchamacallit uh what is it called enamel dot okay then i pick up a shitload of <laughs> washi tape okay i don't know what i what i was thinking but i got so excited they were so inexpensive and um they were also i figure i could use them almost like um i could even use them to create paper with strips in them and so on so let me find where i got these so i can tell you how much now um most of these were between like a bunch of bow bunny one i got the bow bunny um botanical journal most of these are around seven dollars so that means that i got it for 350 and some of them were around nine dollars so between 350 to 450 is not a great deal for basically all of the american craft one was um eight roll of of um washi tape i got the um garden grove collection isn't that beautiful oh my gosh um this was also i think around four dollars this is the joyful christmas collection beautiful um washi 
um, and this one is called Boulevard, a very French country collection that I have already as well. This is called Time and Place. I love this collection. It's kind of like um, Hello Today from Simple Stories where they have like a page or two page for each month of the year. Um, this one is Busy Sidewalk from Crate Paper, the last Christmas collection one. Super cute. I love those houses. And then I got the Heidi Swap. That's actually the, the thing here. Um, this is called um, Carefree. I do have these this paper pad. So I got that um, as well. I think all of the Heidi Swap one was, let's see. Heidi Swap was how much was um okay all Heidi Swap was nine dollars so it's four fifty and I did get the old school one too. I like this collection quite a bit. I do have the paper pad for that. Then I got this one is Hey Hello from uh Jen Hatfield. This is a happy happy fun collection. I got I do have that. This was called the Avenue. This is a pretty one. I love these houses Actually, I got this particular one just for those houses. <laughs> and then I, I um, found the one for This Is Family. That's really pretty too. I do have a lot of paper from this collection. Um, then Maggie Holmes, I picked up the one I don't already have is, is Heritage. I don't have a huge number of paper from this collection, but it's one that I do like. This is Marigold. I have some paper from this collection, but again, not a lot. It was before I started buying paper again. And I did pick up the, because I love these stamps, uh, the sticker rolls that have these cute um, forest cute animals, as well as the poster stamp. You guys already seen all those. And then one uh, Canoe 2, the collection called Willow. I really like this one with the butterfly got that and the pebbles i got the collection called kid at heart that's the new one that they came out for valentine and look how cute that is i love the the polka dot multicolor polka dot and the um ice cream cone this one is an older collection called lovely moments i love this this collection i didn't get the big paper pad yet but i do have um some six by eight paper pad from from um from that collection and this is f fun sun and fun it's a, such a cute again they got the ice cream and flip flop and just really fun colors um in that collection i do have the paper pad for that and this one fifth and monocle from pink paisley look how pretty the flowers are i just fussy cut the whole piece of paper that had all these flowers from the actual paper collection it's so pretty. I got those. And then I got Bloom Street. I think this was a Paige Evans collection. I don't have a lot of this collection. I've been looking for paper for this collection. But I love these cute little butterfly washi here. Um, and so I got it. And it was all like around $4 for all of them. So, so like that's mean that each. And you get a lot, by the way. You get um, six yards per roll. And that's 18 feet. That's crazy, right? Um, and, and you time that by eight. This is Chimel Never Grow Up. Um, I got I do have papers for this collection. I think it's just a cute, fun, uh, fun, happy collection to pick up. And then I did get a Vicky Beaton um, Warm Wishes. I do have this collection. I don't have the washi yet. And I think it's just so pretty. I love everything. Vicky Booten, so that's fine. This is an older Vicky Booten collection called Storyteller, and I I love it. So I picked that up as well. I don't have very much, very many papers from this collection yet. I'm looking for it, but nevertheless, and this is also also an old collection called Let's Wander. I don't have hardly any paper from this collection, but I seen it and I really like it. And I'm hoping to find some to pick up. Okay. I got that and then I did get the um, Happy Hearts, the new collection for Valentine from Simple Stories in from um, February of this year. And I did buy the collection for that. So I have now I have the washi for it. And then uh, for the first time ever, I found I never even knew 
I, that's that's my bad because I don't collect as much um, uh, stuff from Pink Fresh Studio yet. But they have this beautiful four inch roll of washi tape. And you get a lot, but it's like every nine inches or so, you get all these pattern repeats again. And they even have dies that they sell with this so that you can actually put it on paper and just fussy, you know, you can die cut it. I didn't buy the die because they were quite a bit, but I fussy cut everything out and they're so pretty. These gonna make great embellishment for, you know, maybe collections that matches that most of their collections are similar in color this one i saved the thing this one is called joyful bouquet and these were quite a bit more because they what let me see what you get with this um you get let me see the sticker you get hmm it doesn't say it should say that on in the oh yeah you, you get 11 yards so that's what 33 feet of this so this pattern if it's nine inches each of these you get about I don't know 40 40 of each of these sets of embellishment which I thought was excellent and these are normally $15 and I got it for $7.50 per roll so which is pretty good so I got joyful bouquet I also got the um, really pretty um, poinsettia it's called I, did I save the thing? I know I did. But anyway, it's called Poinsettia something. And these are the various things that you get in there. Isn't that pretty? It's all gold foil, sorry. So it, that's why it's glaring a little bit there. And then I got the the one that's called, I think this is called, um, let me see, English Garden. So you get this beautiful wreath. And then all these cute embellishment with that. And again, that's all the the thing you get with the wool. Isn't that neat? I love it. And it's just like I love to fussy cut anyway. And then one of my favorite, and I just dropped it on the floor. So give me a second to pick it up. Um, this one is called Anamone. Anam, Anna, I think it's Anamone. I'm not sure. It's um, so that you get these. And it's like this wispy, you know, kind of flowing flower that drooped down like this. There's my hair. And isn't that so pretty? I love it. Oh my gosh. Isn't that gorgeous? And there's plenty. So you can share it with the crafty friends if you like to. Just roll it out on paper for them. Um, so anyway, I, I cut out one pattern and I've just been storing each of them in one of these. So whenever I'm ready to... to to um, use it or play with it, I have at least one set that's already cut out. And if I ha when I have time, I cut out some more. Okay, so that's my washi. And then I got a whole bunch of, um, um, what do you mean, whatchamacallit, the paper pads. So these, they also were two for one on one of the week. And all of these, were around $8 for the six by eight, I think, except Simple Stories. Simple Stories were only $7. So basically I pay $3.50 or $4 for each of these. So I got all the brand new one. I got the, well, for the six by eight at least, I got the new Bow Bunny Beautiful Things. Let me flip through real quick for you. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that, single-sided um, six by eight paper beautiful i really like this collection it's not pretty just a very pretty subtle colors what i may call kind of like a muted feminine colors this is so cute with these butterflies and that this is not that those flowers tone on tone so pretty look at that oh my gosh it's so pretty and then it should repeat sometime i think it, it's you get it twice right is that yep that's so you get two pieces for each of these they're 36 pages bow bunny also have the brand new one called willow and sage and um is isn't that beautiful roses oh my lord lordy 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 love 
again, kind of muted, beautiful ombre paper, gorgeous. So I think between the two, I like, I really like willow and sage. So that's probably be, that's, isn't that beautiful? That would be the collection I pick up first. And then I believe that repeats right there. Nope. Isn't that pretty? These are great for making cards too, you guys. So happy. So pretty. Then Heidi Swap has a brand new collection called Sun Chaser. This is also the way I um, decide whether or not I want that collect the full collection. Actually, I want all the full collection. But anyway, um, that's what I tell myself. The excuse I tell myself. Sun Chaser is the new one from Heidi Swap. And, ooh, a lot of citrus there pretty she does she does like to do these now they they tend to repeat a bit now you know they're pretty but it's kind of recycled over a little bit oh how such a cute i love those popsicle they're again very pastel these these um just came out so they're they're spring colors so that's why that's cute and that repeats right there okay so that's sun chaser and these are again i picked it up for four dollars this is live and let grow the new collection from jen hatfield and these have gold foil on it it's really pretty um three by four cut apart see the good you grow girl everything will be better when we can be together how cute and this say hello everywhere in a gold foil. Pastel flowers. Butterflies. Look how interesting this plot is. Or gingham or whatever you call it. That's very neat. We've gone fishing here. Some that cute little bird. Some pretty um, wood flower. It's got leaves that's all gold foil. It's cute dragonfly, very tiny. And some flower field. And that. And gingham. Oh, look at this. Um, gold foil butterfly paper. The sun. And this is like two by two cut apart. Very pretty colors. So it looks like there's no repeat in this one at all these are all different similarly with their with her 12 by 12 paper pad there's no no repeats but the paper i think is different i did look at this look at the shells is that cute i love these dots too almost like dot 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 on at the end of a sentence these flowers and that and that's the end okay and then this one is an old one. I got fresh bouquet from uh, Maggie Home. I won't even flip through because I'm sure you guys have seen it. And then I got the new um, Paige Evans Splendid Collection. Yeah. These got gold foil there. Some butterfly. Got the gold foil there. It's a really, I like this collection. It's a very happy color, right? She's always very colorful. But, you know, not not too different from stuff she'd done in the past. So, again, even if you just pick a few pieces of paper here and there that you like from this collection, you can work it in with all the other collection that you may have. I like this paper a lot. Look at these cute birds. That pretty. Ooh, that's neat, neat, neat. This gold foil flowers. That looked like the shell. It looked like very art deco-y um, um, paper. This flower type she always does. I'm, I'm not crazy about that one. It's very pretty. Gold foil flowers. Again, she does not repeat. I like this one with the turquoise. Kind of a deep turquoise paper. It's like denim. Gold foil polka dots on like a navy a dark navy background whoa very very corally and shiny look at these cute 
um, whatever shape that's called. Kind of like a she she shell on the she shore. This is so pretty. Oh, crazy zigzag. Okay, then we'll do Vicky Booten Sweet Rush. It's a new collection for Vicky Booten as well. Look at so Vicky Booten, you get two piece, uh, and they're double sided, so you you do get repeats, and both sheets are at the in the same spot. You see. So this is the front, that's the back. Let's see if I see that or not. Front, back. Pretty, right? Front and back. Got the butterfly and then kind of like almost like a wooden trunk type thing. This is the front, that's the back. I like that side very much. That's the beautiful front. Look at that ombre, whatever. So pretty. And these... Um, very tropical leaves and such an unusual color. That's very nice. Then you get these. And then the orange slice in the back. Got these words on navy blue. And then this whole craft paper. These beautiful flowers that I think I've seen in the past. And that, or similar. Look at that peacock. Beautiful. Yeah, and then that's the back with the sunshine. And then the last one is some more three by five, two, uh, three by four. And then that's the back that you can journal on. And that's the end of that. So you don't get all of the pattern in there. And then this one was $7, so it's $3.50. This is the new collection, Full Bloom, double-sided from Simple Stories. I, do, I have some of the paper from this collection. I mean, I don't have any paper except this. I have some embellishment from this color. This is cute. Don't worry, be happy. The cute bee in the back. Look at the snail. That's cute. Very colorful. And look at this whole page of gardening tools, <laughs> gardening stuff. That's cute too. Yeah, it's really pretty actually. Splash and puddle, fly a kite, listen to the birds sing. There we go, it's cute. There's some three by four, you nailed it. Snail it. I just took some snail photos. They're so cute. It rained a little bit here in Southern California a few weeks back. So all the snail was coming out to say hi. Very pretty, did I repeat somewhere? No, not yet. Okay, I repeats there somewhere. Okay, that's the three, a six by eight. Then I got a bunch of six by six. I never got six by six for 49 in market. So I wanted to try it out, see what it looks like. It seems like it's just as expensive. <laughs> but anyway, so that's the page. But that's so pretty though. You know, so you get two, no, you get one, two, three, four piece of each double-sided pattern. There's the back. Look how pretty. I don't have this collection in a 12 by 12 yet. It's mango, that's actually, I love that color and I love the fruit. So I definitely have to get it. But look at this, it's just like ready to pop in a card, you know, a six by six card that you can put some sentiment, some other stuff in there if you like to. It's really pretty, actually. I like it very much. And the 49 in Market um, 6x6 collection was, let's see how much. Um, was that 49? That was $6, $6, so that's only $3. Look at the cut apart sheets, and you get also four of that. Okay, so that's the... Um, 49 and market. Chow Bella have this new thing. Um, it's normally seven, they call it a fussy cut pads. They're also six by six. And they just start marketing it for some of their newer collection that just introduced this year. And they're seven dollars normally, so I got it for three fifty. And look how pretty. So you get one, two, three, three sheets of eight designs. And they're double uh, are they double sided? Yeah, they're double sided. So this is like the, the part in the front that you need, you can fussy cut, but if you don't like any of that, you can use the back. Look at these dolphins. I love dolphins. 
Oh, how cute is that? So you got a bunch of things to fussy cut, and that's the back. And look at the uh, parrot. Parrot for the pirate. Really nice size, even though it's only a six by six pad. They made the, the oh, I love that. They made the images not tiny like um, Minte does in their fussy cut pads. These are nice, very good size. Look at these, um, what do you call those? Those are not octopus. They're, they're kind of transparent. I can't remember what they're, what they're called, but they're cool looking, these. Um, and some more mermaids. Love my mermaids. This actually, I can hold it up here so you can actually see. And that's the back paper. Oh, kissing under the water. Kissing under the water. The mermaid and the prince. And that's the back. And then we got more kissing on the on the boat, leaning over. How cute! And uh, and that's the wood back. And you have this kind of map, old time map. And this is the front page. Sorry. There you go. So that's really nice for for three fifty. Unbelievable. Okay. So I got that. That's under underwater love. And then I also picked up one called um, Sonora. It's kind of like a, uh, whatchamacallit, um, um, desert thingy. My son is going to be attending um, University of Arizona in Tucson. So I figure it's always, and I love salsa and I love avocado. So there's a lot of things in here that I can cut up. Oh, sorry. Spicy chili, I can cut apart and use. And the cactus is always so pretty. My um, my brother-in-law loves to grow cactus. He has a bunch of them in his beautiful garden. He has even a tree. They they build a tree, not a tree house, a class house. In you know the yeah the class house right the plant class house. I don't know what they're called exactly, but um, in his his backyard. So he has an enclosed class house. So that way, you know, when the weather get too hot or too cold or whatever in California, they can um, they can still grow stuff in there. Yeah, they never buy any vegetables. My sister just go out in the garden and get her tomatoes. They have the sweetest, they grow the sweetest heirloom tomatoes. Um, lately, we haven't been able to get some because it's been so hot and they all got bad but look at these very pretty very pretty collection and then this is the last piece so you get a lot for this especially at this half price point okay so that was sonora and i got a new collection six by six paper pad from photoplay called boarding pass i was just curious about this collection so i got this in um for the time being it is double-sided so this is the kind of journaling page that's the back i got this pretty hot air balloon paper the back is the compass and that's the it's a little bit more manly and that's the back it's the front with a bunch of luggage that's the back the street map and these are the tickets or the, what do you call it not tickets luggage tags and that's the back yeah it has nice manly colors that you can use for other things. Not all girls like pink, right? And those, but I do. <laughs> That's my favorite color. Map of the world. And this pretty, what do you call them? Traveling words. And you have some more. Is it the same one? Is that the repeat? No. Yeah, so it repeats there. So you actually get three of each design. You get um, eight. You get eight uh, double-sided design and you get three pieces of paper for each of those. Then I also picked up the new Pink Fresh Studio Happy Heart collection in the six by six. Um, these are also on were on sale for, let me see. These are $7, so they're $3.50 each. Look how pretty that is. I do have this collection. I haven't shared with you yet, but I will soon. There's that. Look at the uh, butterfly, super pretty. Very nice. Oh, cute windows. 
so the oh i like that it's not neat i love that can't wait to see that in the 12 by 12 because i haven't even looked at it i bought it but i haven't looked at it i love that oh my goodness so cute and it repeats in the middle okay then i um i picked up also the new one called life right now this one is kind of like also a little bit more like um today type thing you know everyday moments type i like that this say it's fine i'm fine everything's fine <laughs> that's funny that's cute okay it's okay to go at your own pace okay i understand i get some cute um tea thingy that's the back take care real life make it up as i go along <laughs> make the most of what you got cute so this remind me a, a bit of um what, what, what was the collection that was uh, keeping it real right it's a little bit similar to that cute that some more tea i love that some cut apart In the back i like these cute little um, tag thingy and this one say make time for fun uh real life is full of up and down here my favorite place to be is here very pretty and some map and then whatever you call this tags or something or another very pretty oh that's a bright yellow and then it repeats yeah very pretty and i did pick up a couple i didn't even open it because they've been around it's called some days and i'm sure you already seen it so i won't even bother but for that price i did want to get i have this collection already but i wanted to get the um six by six paper pad okay and i also picked up the the best day i have that collection as well how come this paper pad is so much thicker than this one this one have 32 piece of paper for the same price basically i think and this one has 24. So I guess they used to make it, they, maybe they used to make it thicker. I don't know. Not sure. I'm sure the, the thicker one is more expensive because that's eight piece more paper. But it is an older collection, so it's probably the same. Okay, then I also was able to pick up the 6x6. Six six. Sorry, let me, this, I'm just being anal. Um, let me just take this apart before it drives me nuts. Um, the, um, I picked up the new... Um, Farm Sweet Farm from Prima, the 6x6 six six paper pad. Look how pretty that is. So you get, with Prima, you get one, two, three, four, five piece of 6x6. Six six. There's some tags or some cut apart. Get six of those. And then look at the bunny in the reef. And that's the back. That's the back. Cute. Then you get kind of like the chicken wire and that's the back and these kind of pretty reef thingy and the back that's an interesting gingham pattern there and the last paper is that floral with this sweet farm newspaper paper and then meal is the brand new collection from frank garcia and he always have very very pretty um colors this is a really nice you know what do you call these um checkout paper or whatever not checkout paper you know what i mean and let's look at the bees on there so pretty huh and that's the back this is that's a really pretty collection i should get the full paper pads on this when it's on sale very very nice and that's the back and you get this Kind of already sort of layout collage paper make it super easy that's paris theater and then that's the back and you have these two smaller not two by twos but these cut apart and that's the back <laughs> Look like a little strips of paper a strip of washi tape and you got this beautiful wreath yeah this is going to be looking really nice in the big one and that's the back and then the this paper is all tags. Real pretty. And that's the back, the pink back. 
then you get this cute, sweet, actually, very sweet. Look at her. Can you see that? Paper, and then that's the back. Okay, so very spring-like one. And then I got the My Sweet, which is an older collection. You've already seen it, so I don't need to worry, but very pretty. This is one of my... I do have this in the big one, too, but... And this is Nature Lover, which you may or may not have seen. It's not that old. It's the back, and then this is the um, sort of collage paper in the front. And you get a bunch of birds, real pretty. And that's the back paper. And you get the a butterfly, and the back has kind of blue, light blue, really pretty color blue. And you have these kind of cut apart. And then the stripes in the back. Get this black and white floral paper. And this collage paper in the back. That's really pretty, huh? And you get this one. Kind of a like a medium blue. Well, not royal, but really pretty blue. And this one's just polka dots. Yeah? In the back. So that was my uh, Nature Lover. And I did pick up Peach Tea, which is the new one that just came out from Frank Garcia as well. So you get this one. He always does this kind of collage bit. Love these jar. And that look at that wood. Oh my lord, how gorgeous. Right? And these hot air balloons. I love this. Can't wait to get the big paper and fussy cut them up. That's really pretty. And then you get this one, which is kind of like got beautiful balloons there the mason jar which i love and this beautiful mason jar paper is in the back of that paper and you get this one all the wreath and the back is these cut apart um, tag so nice then you get these other cut aparts a little bit smaller in the back in the front and the back just have all these Look at, is that apricot or something? Oh, they looks delicious. Oh, can't wait till summer. And all of the amazing fruits we're gonna get. What's your favorite fruit? We've been eating watermelon because that's my dog's favorite fruit. So we always try to get, find watermelon for them. Okay, and this is the back of that beautiful paper right here. Okay, so that was that. And then this is old, so I won't even bother, but it's a, um, traveling girl it's julie nutting the paper doll paper so just got a lot of different types smaller paper smaller print paper and stuff like that okay so that is my paper pad now i did pick up a gazillion six by six paper pad as well let me see if i can oops let me see if i can find that and i won't even um I don't even remember where I put it. I think I put it away already, but I got a whole bunch of... No, I didn't. I There's no way I did, because I got the new... I got a Cartabella Summer Collection paper pad, the 6x6, six six, that's not new. I did get the new Farmhouse Summer, Believe in the Magic, which is the new Disney one from Cartabella, Beach Party. I did get um, Hello Valentine, which is not new, but I don't have the paper pad. I got New Day, Endless Summer, a bunch of new collection. Um, anyway, for $3.15 each. Um, but I don't know where I put that. <laughs> anyway, I think that is all I have for now. I better stop. Um, I am, uh, I can't wait. I will be coming back up next. I wanted to show something pretty and not just have this plain, this plain background. Um, I will be back on Saturday, I think. With, no, Monday with a um, YouTube hop to, to celebrate my friend Joanne Bartel. Um, I believe it's her thousand subscriber hop or something like that. So hopefully I get my shit together 
and have that um, a layout ready for you to um, to watch along with a whole bunch of uh, crafty friends that's going to be helping Joanne celebrate her um, special milestones. All right, you guys. Well, it was nice to see you, talk to you, and whatever else. And I wish you have a wonderful rest of the week. Enjoy your weekend. And oh, I'm so sorry. Happy Mother's Day. Belated since I, I wasn't on um, earlier to wish you guys all Happy Mother's Day. I hope you had enjoy your, your special day with your family. And I will see you guys real soon. Bye.